Hey guys, welcome back to another week in my life. I'm not gonna look at the camera because I am driving to work right now. But happy Monday. Today is October, well, today is October 7th and I have work, class, and then senior group today. Mondays are my longest days for sure. So I'm just trying to vibe. Um, but anyway, yeah, I just wanna say hey. I'm probably gonna go just to be safe while I'm driving. I also wanna listen to some music. So yeah, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye. Hey guys. Okay, back in the car. I am done with work. I actually just got to campus. I have class in 24 minutes. I actually have to walk further than I normally do. So I'm actually probably going to go because um, today we're going to the Spencer Research Library for the first half of class. Um, so I'm going to make this quick. But Lana and I decided instead of going to Sea Group, we're going to go over to Ethan's family's house. Um because they're hosting like a Chiefs Royals watch party. Um, I have like gone to the the Chiefs games at Ethan's house since I think the first time I went was in high school so it's kind of fun. It's just been such a long time sparsely but like here and there and it's just cool like oh my gosh I like the first time I went over to Ethan's house I think I was like 16 or 15 or something like that and so it's just funny. Um, but anyway yeah we are gonna or I'm gonna go and I'll chat with you guys after class probably. But yeah, just want to say hey, update you guys, uh, keep sh making sure that this video has content. But I'm gonna go. Bye. Morning, everyone. Happy Tuesday. I just realized one of the screws of my camera fell out again in January. Both of the screws fell out, and I had to put in some new screws. So I'm gonna have to tighten the one that's in there and try to find a another one because those screws are hard to come by I ended up using like a pair of glasses to fix it so i'm gonna have to be really careful with that um for work in nine minutes i didn't my alarm didn't go off this morning because i set it wrong i set it for 7 45 p.m versus a.m pretty chill day that i'm ahead of me um i don't think i'm gonna like bring a full lunch today because I only work until one and I just don't have the time so I'm packing some yogurt and like a snack thing and some peanuts hey guys okay we're back in the kitchen I know the last clip was just in here obviously or actually maybe not that obvious I am just now getting back from work it is 1 13 I have a zoom meeting at 30 so I'm gonna put away my lunch stuff um I actually don't know if Anna and I are gonna I can't remember I think I said we were thinking about going to see substance um at like three something I was planning on going home um Wednesday or Thursday but I think she might leave today only at a dentist appointment sorry Anna to like share your personal details but um she's at a dentist appointment right now so I'll find out after she's done with that, which is why I'm sharing that information. I got Halloween candy for Halloween to hand out for the kids in our neighborhood because I live in like an actual neighborhood and I've been eating the candy and I fear that by October 31st it's gonna be gone. Okay, we're back in my kitchen again. I'm with Anna this time. We just got done watching The Substance. Give your thoughts while I'm unloading my groceries. I don't know what to think, is what I think. Um, I hate it and I love it at the same time. Um, I wanna rate it one star and also maybe four and a half is as high as I'd give it. Um, I love the concept, like the idea behind it, totally get it, awesome. I think they did, they ran with it in a really interesting way. I also am someone that hates needles and blood and gore. Um, and so for that reason, I would want to rate it a negative five because it was filled with that and it did make me gag several times. Um, I was nervous I was going to have to leave uh, it's at certain points of the movie. I also felt like it just kept going, which I get, but there were several moments where I was like, okay, I feel like we can wrap it up here and I would have gotten the message the same. Um, I think overall I would give it, I think I'm going to rate it a three on Letterboxd. I think that's a pretty good rating. Which, yeah, because it's like, I, it's, it's a pretty good rating. 
pretty even for me in terms of like it's good and I like it and I get it and like Aubrey said it's camp um but also I never want to see that thing ever again in my life <laughs> and don't bring it anywhere near me so that's my review yes I think that's very valid I'm rating it four stars disgusting I feel a little sick and I knew Anna, every time something like kind of graphic or a needle popped in, I like looked over at Anna. She's like, oh! <laughs> and I, I thought that to. was really funny. So personally, that made the watch experience a little bit better for me, more enjoyable for me. Also, wait really quick. Um, what did that person say? There was a um, person on Letterboxd that said this is the Barbie, mo the Barbie movie for Charlie XCX fans and it made me laugh. That is awesome. Um, also, someone said A24 must be really mad that this company got a horror movie of the year. Yeah, no, actually. Because it does seem like an A24 film. Yeah, it does. The Also, look at what I got at Target today. <gasps> so cute! I just found my jean skirt in my drawer the other day. I was like, I need to wear it, but it's so short. Like, if I do anything, it's going to pop my I'm head. worried because th this feels short. It's a size 6, though, which I'm usually an 8. But they only have this in a size four, so I just got it and it's like I'll return it. But it's yeah. since it's Circle Week, it was sixteen dollars instead of twenty four. I forgot it's Circle Week. So nice. Yeah, I got that and got more socks. Yes, I need to get more socks. Mine are disappearing. Oh yeah. yeah. I know. Love. That's not good. I can never go back. Bye. Okay. Anyway, I just put away all my food. Um, so I need to put these back in my trunk, but I'm going to do that and then I'll talk to you after. Hey, hey, we're back in the kitchen. Yay. Um, no, actually I just got done babysitting. Just got back. It's 8:20 on the dot. Um, I need to leave by 8:45, So I have about 25 minutes to gather my bearings. Um, because this morning I obviously didn't get that much time to do that. So really that just entails, I have a hot yoga class after work at four today. So I'm going to, I'm already wearing my sports bra, bringing these, change into, I'm also bringing the skirt that I got yesterday. It's too small, so I want to return it. And then I think I'm gonna try to buy it online actually. I should probably do that. What else, what else do I need to do? I need to pack a lunch and I think that's it. I'm not gonna worry about makeup or anything like that. Ooh, I need a hair tie need a hair tie and I think I'm gonna leave it at that really um so today I have work oh it's the awkward angle welcome to my bathroom this is a really weird angle guys hey um I'm gonna get a hair tie that's what I'm doing okay, okay my battery died but anyway I don't know what I was saying I'm gonna go I have my hair tie my yoga shorts Oh, I need a towel too. Okay, good. I'm actually glad I'm recording right now because that would have sucked if I had to pay $3 to borrow one. But yeah, I think this is all I need. I'm going to run to Target after my hot yoga class, which will be gross because I'll be super sweaty. Um, but I'd rather do it like while I'm out and about. So that's the plan. Take these. Um, now I need to do a lunch really fast. Well... This angle is quite something. Anyway, so just want to say hey. I'm going to go now because I don't have that much time and I want to make sure I'm eating a good lunch and breakfast. So, bye. Hey, everyone. Happy Thursday. It's actually 7.30 right now. Yes, I am ready for bed. What do you have to say about it? Um. Anyway, so today I... I didn't really do anything fun. I worked today and I had my writing group that I joined to work on my thesis. I got some pages done. Oh. Need to grab my tripod, but I don't really want to. That I came back and made some white chicken chili. It was so good. I should have vlogged when I was doing it, but I was watching Buffy the Vampire Slayer. I finished the first season. This is my first time ever watching it, and oh my gosh, I love it. It's so like old. But I'm ex obsessed. Um, spoilers. If you don't want spoil Buffy the Vampire Slayer spoiled, skip ahead like 30 seconds. Um, it like kind of crushed me when Xander expressed his feelings to Buffy. And she obviously didn't reciprocate. And I know that. 
Um, I personally don't like Angel. Like, I, based on what I know, I don't like Spike necessarily, but, like, I think... I don't think Angel's, like, her one true love. Anyway, I, like, I would date Xander. Like, he's so cute. Are you kidding me? He's obsessed with her. He's funny. He's hot. Um, but anyway. So, yeah, I finished the season finale of that while I was cooking it, so I was not vlogging. And it was actually pretty good. I'm impressed. I'm impressed by myself. That was my first time making any sort of chili. And so, it was good. I definitely am not the greatest at cooking chicken, I just, I think I overcook it because I get so scared that I'm going to undercook it and then it's kind of like tough. If you know, you know. I need to have London like show me because he makes the best chicken ever. But anyway, did that. Um, Major and Ashley were supposed to come over tonight, but it got postponed to tomorrow. So they're going to hang out tomorrow night. Um, and of course, I'll probably vlog that. We're probably going to watch the Vampire Diaries. And, um, yeah, we ended on the season finale of season one, so we're going to be starting season two. And if you know what happens in the finale of season one, oh, I am, like, on the edge of my seat. I, Major has never seen it. Ashley has, like, seen bits, but, like, she hasn't. And so I'm just, I feel, I love watching things with people who haven't seen it because it, I, I'm, like, watching it for the first time as well. And I just, I love that. So, anyway, tomorrow's pretty open day. I have hot yoga at 8. Um, I am going to clean the house since I'll be out of town on Saturday, which is usually when I clean the house. Um, so, I'm going to do that tomorrow. I am hoping to work on my thesis. I really want to get my, like, my goal for this week done tomorrow. That would be really awesome. And just chill until I hang out with the gals. But... It's pretty, pretty slow day tomorrow, which I'm looking forward to. It'll be like a good rest day, but also hopefully productive is my hope. Yeah. But anyway, um, my friend Allison gave me this little card. It says a perfect pair. It's actually for London and I. Uh, which one are we? Which one's London? Which one's me? Please let me know. Um, but yeah, I actually need to show London this. That way he can also tell her thank you. But anyway... Yeah, I have been doing a thing where I've been trying to not have food three hours before bed, not have any liquids two hours before bed, and then be off my phone an hour before bed, which is why I'm already, I am going to get off my phone and like screens at 8.15 and just read for an hour before I go to bed, which I might stay up later because I'm currently reading a Draco and Hermione fan fiction. Guys, I am not a fan fiction person. Well, I was when I was a kid. I was on... I was on a Wattpad for sure, but it's not really my thing, but I read the auction and I've read it three times. I read it three times this year in 2024, I'm pretty sure. It's the best fan fiction I've ever heard. She's, I think she's removed it and it's actually being created into like a real novel, which immediately I will be buying that. This reminds me, I need to check up on that. I'm going to look at it actually. <laughs> Shut up. All I'm seeing is it will be called Alchemize and it is coming out in 2025. And guys, you have no idea. I'm so excited. Like I will be purchasing that immediately because Manacled was written so, so well. I have it downloaded on my Kindle, thankfully, so I don't need AO3 anymore. But oh, you guys have to read it. I am not a Draco and Hermione stan. Like, in the movies, in the books, like, they do not belong together. My personal, like, pairings in the books, it's Hermione and Ron. In the movies, it's Hermione and Harry. And in fan fiction, it's Hermione and Draco. 100%. That's my personal opinion on the situation. But... Anyway, I also have read The Auction, and that is technically the third book in a series. So I'm currently, I read the first book, and now I'm reading the second book. I don't think I'll reread The Auction, but I wanted to read the complete series because they're kind of alternate universes of an alternate universe, um, where the first one, the first book is if Harry Potter won the war from Hermione's point of view, and then the second book is the same thing, but from Draco's point of view. And then the third is the same universe, but if they had lost the war. And so, it's very good. I recommend it. I will say, people tell you to 
read the first two because you can like point out like how they're actual like alternate universes of each other through like certain symbols or hinge points which I can do that from having read the auction first so I, I don't think it really matters all that much but the auction is a lot more depressing obviously than um the right things to do and the wrong thing I think that's what the first two are called but anyway I'm getting on a ramble this has been so long but anyway that's what that's why I'm ready for bed so early so I'm gonna read or I might watch a YouTube video before I have to turn off my phone but yeah that's the update for now I will hopefully vlog a little bit more tomorrow because I did not vlog at all today clearly um but yeah Anna's out of town. She left yesterday um, morning, so I saw her a little bit on Tuesday, but I kind of had the house to myself, which I'm not doing anything crazy, so it doesn't really matter, but anyway, that's it. Talk later. <laughs> oh, okay, bye. Good morning, everyone. Happy Friday. It is 7.30. I actually think I'm going to cancel my yoga class. I know I would feel so good after it, but part of me just wants to clean right now and like listen to a book. Um, so I hate that I'm doing this, but I don't. I think, I think it'll be good. I think I'm going to try to run today or go on a long walk. That'll be my goal is to do one of those two things to kind of like make up for missing yoga cancel that um the only reason i cancel those is because it doesn't harm me at all like i know a lot of people who cancel classes they have to still pay for them but i don't thankfully um so i don't have to worry about that but anyway i'm just gonna grab like all of my towels and things like this because i'm gonna put in my sheets and towel load of laundry whoa it's giving twilight right now um Whoa, it's so blue in here. That's awesome. Um, anyway, so I'm going to do that. And then I'm going to eat breakfast. And then I'm going to start cleaning. So, yeah. That's kind of the update. I'm watching a YouTube video right now. I'm probably going to finish that. And then I'll probably start listening to an audiobook or something like that while I'm cleaning. But just want to say hey. Update you guys. And, yeah. I will chat later. The young woman. The other woman Hey guys, I don't remember the last day I vlogged, but it is Sunday right now. And Lemon and I are about to go take engagement photos, part two. Our wedding photographer is in town, so he's taking them. It is almost five. We're gonna leave here at five. It's five, it's 4 41. Um, but yeah, I'm just reading this. We're doing a downtown shoot since Gracie did like an outside wilderness vibe, nature outdoorsy nature you know the likes of it but anyway yeah yesterday we went to Missouri to visit London's family and we were there for the day I didn't vlog because I don't know we we're just seeing his family and stuff there wasn't really I don't know didn't see a point to vlogging we did watch 21 Jump Street last night and it was so funny I've seen that movie but it's been a very very long time and so it basically was like I was watching it for the first time and guys, if you like comedy, you have to watch it. It was so funny. Um, and we're definitely going to have to watch the second one. That is like at the top of our watch list now. But I just realized I need to water my plant. I watered all my plants except for this one up here. And she's looking sad. She's turning yellow. So I'm going to go throw this in my shower and water her. Okay, done with that. Wow, my bookshelf looks so bare without that. But anyway, I am just getting things together. I did a quick load of laundry and I think I'm going to go clean up downstairs, like put my laptop and stuff away because I was working on my thesis earlier. 
because I have pages due today, which I got done, which I'm very excited about. I got those done at like 2.30, so that was really nice for the last two and a half hours to not have to worry about that. But anyway, just want to update. I'm not going to end this here, although this will probably be <laughs> the last clip, but there's luck that I'll vlog beyond this, so we'll wait and see. So yeah, happy Sunday.